Here are the conjugates, and here are the products. Great work if you found at least four of those. We know for the conjugate, we just changed the sign between the two terms. So the conjugate of one minus root 11 is one plus root 11. Here we change the subtraction sign to a positive, and here we change the positive sign to a negative. For the products, we want to use our pattern for the difference of two squares. We know the product of two binomials with differing signs will be a squared minus b squared. So we can square a, which is one here, and square b, which is the root of 11. One squared equals one, and root 11 squared equals 11. We find the difference of these squares, which is one minus 11, which equals negative 10. For the second one, when we square the a term, we'll have nine times two. We square the three and we square the root two. For b squared, we'll square two, which is four, and we'll square the square root of three, which equals three. We know nine times two is 18 and four times three is 12. This gives us a final answer of six. And for the last one, we'll have negative five squared for our a term and six root two squared for the b. Negative five squared is 25 and six root two squared is 36 times two or 72. 25 minus 72 equals negative 47.